watching the chemistry between you and Ashley, was, was that one of the reasons you wanted to do the movie, to come back and work with her again, or was like the... Well, yeah, the, you know, um, when you work with someone who, I don't know, that does um, turn that loose, spark that, whatever it is, uh, it's always a bigger joy to do it again, you know. Uh, it's like in New York, working on a stage, a lot of times you work with the same actors yeah. over more than one time, and you get to know each other very well. In Hollywood, we don't do it as much, you know, because there's so many of us uh, that uh, we just, just keep revolving, kind of like, not even revolving, we're just going from, from partner to partner. But yeah, we do have a very close relationship off the screen anyway, so it makes it much easier and much nicer. And yeah, I think we probably do have some kind of thing going on. Right. Charlie's a has-been. Uh, he was uh, in the military. He was a crackerjack lawyer, uh, probably a defense attorney, worked for the Judge Advocate General's Office, Corps, that's a Corps, Jack Corps in the Marine, and um, ran afoul of everything, mm -hmm. alcohol, um, wrong woman, and was drummed out of the Corps, he was forced to resign. And then he, by that time, he was an alcoholic, functioning alcoholic, mm -hmm. and now he's a recovering alcoholic, um, very low on ambition and living life the way a lot of alcoholics do, one day at a time, you know, and quite content with his lot, apparently, mm -hmm. until she shows up. And then he goes back to what he wants well, to be. Well, he, he, she needs help from someone who knows how to do it, and he responds to that, of course, and, you know, life takes on more meaning for him, I guess, after a while man who's been um, in the higher echelons of life, law, uh, who gives it up, knows what he's given up, and if he's happy that way, then that's fine, and I think he was happy that way. But nobody is, is really happy uh, functioning at lower than mm -hmm. their peak potential, so it's more than likely that he wasn't totally happy. A recovering alcoholic is, a, is, is fine, is healthy, is, you know, it's, it's just that uh, it's something you have to guard against, you know. Uh, an alcoholic is a person who just cannot take a drink, you know. So he's fine. He's fine. As long as he's not pushed into that situation, of course, um, you do as happens to him, he gets into a situation where he, he makes, a, makes a judgment about it, you know. Do I dare do this? Mm -hmm. Is this cause worth it, you know? No, she was, how are you looking for what you think is the truth, you know? Uh, we're always looking for the truth in things. Uh, in this case, the idea is that the truth is what will help her husband. She's uh, hands-on. Uh, a lot of directors don't involve themselves in directing as such, you know. Uh, they hire you, and that's as much as they're going to do in terms of you. Um, and uh, other directors hire you and then kind of spend a lot of time tweaking you. And uh, he's a tweaker. Hmm. <laughs> well, I'm hired to do, I'm hired to work. I'm hired to bring whatever uh, I'm hired by the director to do what the director wants, so it's not really about whether or not I like it. Mm -hmm. um, my, I think I feel my job is to try and accommodate as much as possible and be as accommodating as I can and not be a pain in the butt. <laughs> I, I never have anything I ne that, that I need the audience to take from anything. You go in, you pay your money, you come out, I hope you got your money's worth. You know, that's, that's it. Don't, don't, don't come away with any Thing esoteric. I don't, I don't want you to start re-examining your life or anything like that. You know, did you get your money's worth? Were you entertained? Good.
This is, no, no, symptomatic of a new era. I don't think it's the beginning of a new era. The new era was years ago. Mm -hmm. I mean, we were just, we had just, we just taking steps, one step at a time, you know. We're going to wherever we're going. And uh, every now and then you'll get to a plateau or something where you can look back on where you've come. And this is one of those times, I think, that we're at a plateau where we can look back and see from whence we've come.